C. Lindelof videos, TI Inspire cast, a few tips to make life easier. I'm going to try to keep this to two minutes and just a couple of really quick tips. So let's just go uh, to your calculator. So here's some really quick stuff. One, if I want to solve an equation, I can type in S O L V E, solve, and I can type in the equation. Or, or if I wanted to, to do exactly the same thing, I could search the catalog. So here's the catalog. So here I am in the section that is P. If I want to go to the S, look, I just type the S, and then I can wrap down through here. And if you look, you can see that you have solve. Exactly the same thing. So two ways to get to the same place. Next thing, really quick, I'm going to try to keep this really, really fast. What if you are getting back these, if you, I'm hoping you have a cast, and if you have a cast, then you will have this benefit and problem. You're like, okay, I want to do pi times something. So you're like, I, I want pi times 2. And then you get 2 pi back, and I keep getting these questions. How come I keep getting back this symbolic answer? It's a symbolic answer because it's the best answer that there is. There is no rounding. However, in a pinch, if you wanted it rounded, you could say, give me the estimation of that. So if you look right over the enter key right here, there's the estimation key. And there's that. So on a lot of exams that you take, to the third point, so on a lot of exams you take, they say they want this answer, and you keep, you keep missing a little bit. You're like, how the hell am I missing by this? Well, one way that you're missing is that so you're gonna, let's say you're going to take this number right here and you're going to multiply it by another number. What a lot of people will do is they'll type in 6.28319, which makes a certain amount of sense. However, if you use your cursor key here, check this out. If you hit enter, it drags out its floated value. So you have less rounding error, but you didn't have to type all that crap in. So those are kind of the things that I wanted to give you. The other thing I would like to give you is this. I would love for you to go to the menu and go through some of this stuff and go through these things and then text and then let me know what you want to talk about because it can do a million times more than even I think it can do. So those are your five tips. I hope they're helpful. If you have any questions or comments, let me know. And if you haven't already subscribed, please do. Thanks.